கட்டணை தோறும் மலக்கேடு மாந்தருக்கு கட்டணை தோறும் அறிவு உம்மடி தோழடா ஆன் பிக் ஆஃப் டிவாம் ரைட்டிங் வெல்ஜ் ரைட்டிங் இன்ஜினியரிங் காலேஜ் வெல்கம்ஸ் யூஆர் லெட் எஸ் ஸ்டாண்ட் ஃபார் பிரேயர் ஸ்டாங்
already time is 11.30. So, not to take much of time. And the participants from even from other colleges, they are very eager to learn what is this machine learning with Python. With the Python. So, the talk of the town today is the, the machine learning as well as the Python. Program Python. Programming it is an open source, you know, FOS, FOSS, free open source language actually. Today, the latest, now the current trend which talks about uh, the machine learning. Always you are moving with machines. You are moving with machines instead of humans. Machines are doing the majority, you know, the work what is now being carried out. So therefore, for a machine learning, you have you know, huge amount of uh, data. What is that the data actually which is useful or uh, not useful? How you have to make useful? So therefore, how this machine is also going to use such kinds of uh, data, something like a data science, right? Or big data, or you say data analytics. How you are going to Know, analyze these data. You may use you know, various tools, you know, the methods, techniques to categorize these data. So the machines also are going to take as input these data. You may say that whether it is trained or untrained data, like uh, supervised or unsupervised or labeled or unlabeled you know, you know, data. So, like that, you know, this machine learning helps. And that reduces your time. That reduces your time, what you do manually, right? And what you arrive, the outcome, or the, the results, net results. All these things can be achieved through machines. All these things can be achieved through machines. So therefore, machines are now getting automated, you know, with the, all these uh, data. So therefore, with improved, you know, performance, efficiency, that it, you can see that what is that accuracy that you want in place. So for which this machine learning plays the major role. Machine learning plays the major role. We do not know what the computer does. You give some input automatically a program that runs and that you know throws out some you know, you know, what what is called the result or you say that the output. The result the, the output. Now all these kinds you know the machine learning now it takes the input as well as or some kind of output as an input and then that produces some good you know, developments in algorithms in giving you know better you know what to say that the performance better performance so therefore with the help of this machine learning going for developing some what to say that uh, the algorithms where that can compute you know the mathematical the calculation and where it can produce some good results by using the languages by using the Languages, the free open source, you know, the languages. I think that this, uh, you know, workshop that helps you for this, uh, you know, four days where you can learn something, you know, you know, in a better way and where you can even reproduce when you go back to your home institution. So therefore, you, your students are also, you know, can benefit out of this. So therefore, our uh, academic uh, resource persons, research scholars from Anna University. So I think. Uh, now during research, you know, they come up with a lot of, uh, you know, survey and learning, you know, many other languages and their uh, new, you know, concepts and uh, uh, where they come with uh, the articles with some innovation. So all these things helps that uh, the reason for inviting research scholars, they will be having much of uh, the knowledge with the current trends uh, with their research, with their research. So therefore, they can give much useful, you know, input for the uh, faculty members with the educational institutions. So for which we have invited the research scholars for this, uh, what to call this machine learning with Python. Machine learning with Python. So have a wonderful workshop. Wish you good luck uh, to all. Uh, thank you. Thank you so much. So I request our Guru sir to please the objective.
give the introduction about our chief guest. Yes, Mr. Varun Kumar, who had completed his B and MTech in Computer Science and Engineering and pursuing his PhD in Network Security. He has done many researches in the field of network security, targeted cyber attacks, advanced persistent threats, and also in malware analysis. He has worked as an assistant professor in Baytech University from June. 2014 to June 2016. His research experience includes automatic lead wing extraction, line IDs, a novel method for traffic classification of resembles using ensemble of classifiers, performance analysis of security framework for software defined network architecture, malware traffic classification using principal component analysis and artificial neural network are notable. He has published nine papers in Scopus Index journals and six papers in conference proceedings, which includes Springer and IEEE Explore. He had organized workshop in machine learning and cloud computing. Currently, he is working with five active projects, which includes analyzing social media traffic, vulnerability assessment and penetration testing, and also in cloud computing. He is also acting as a reviewer in LCBAR and International Journal of Cognitive Informatics and Natural Intelligence. Thank you. Now I request our chief guest, Mr. Sharan Kumar, to deliver the address of the group staff. Sir, so, any idea about what is machine learning? Can you say students from students' point of view? What is machine learning? Not from you, I'm asking for students. Of course, we can take as an audience. Okay, uh, nothing. Uh, for example, machine learning is nothing but we have to teach the machine. Right? Machine wants to learn from experience. Okay? Uh, environmental experience. For example, if we want to define a machine, uh, Apple, right? If you give any Apple image to the machine, it will recognize this is Apple. That we have to teach to the patient through the experience. Right? Purida, in a separate time. Purida, machine is going to tell us what we are going to do. What we are going to do is just like a training. Training and testing. What we are going to do is one image is going to do for a machine or a rack or an image, we have to extract the features from that apple, apple image. For that, apple color, apple shape, okay. We have to take the features and we have to train the, uh, we have to train the features and we have to give the input to the uh, machine, okay. And we have, uh, afterwards, after, after training, we have to give uh, output. For example, new apple image, okay. Based on the previous training, training set, we have to uh, get the output as an apple. Purida, Pala train the data which machine on the predict for it. It is not apple, I mean, the predict for it. Okay, la. the simple example of uh, machine learning. Okay, la. but next four days, I'm going to go to the next four days. Every train, what are the training methods and what are the testing, testing methods? What are the new technologies in the machine learning? What are the core concepts of machine learning? What what is the approach of machine learning to various industries? For example, various uh, technologies, big data, cloud, network security, and image processing. We have to learn for the past uh, for the next four days. Okay, thank you. Okay, so we are going to start the sessions. I'm going to ask the session to Mr. Arun Kumar.